Hello everyone, today I'd like to introduce how to use KDMP, PC side software, and KDX4 to obtain the data of the original vehicle key of MCB48. This is the original factory key. This is the KD key to be matched. This is the MP decryption cable. It is necessary to take apart the original factory key and solder the MP decryption cable to the original factory keyboard. This is a MQB platform. Later, we'll use it to learn this key and verify its functions. Now we will take out the original key's circuit board and solder the MP decryption cable to the original key's circuit board. Open the PC side software. Click Programming Functions. Click KDMP. Click MQB48. Click Wiring Diagram. You can see the circuit board's wiring diagram. Now, the circuit board has been connected according to the wiring diagram. Note, the capacitor indicated by the yellow arrow needs to be removed. Now we have removed the capacitor. Now we'll connect the MP decryption cable. Now place the soldered circuit board on the induction area. Note, something must be placed under the circuit board, and the board should be laid flat on top of it. Otherwise, it cannot be read. If it is this type of key appearance, placed flat on the cushion like this, it cannot be collected. It must be inserted on it like this to be able to collect or insert it here. Otherwise, it cannot be collected. This cushion can also be replaced with other items such as paper towels to fill this frame. It only needs to allow the circuit board to be inserted on it. Now connect the USB cable. Now go back to the previous PC side software interface and identify the key. Identification successful. Click collect key data. Follow the prompts to proceed to the next step. Now, let's wait patiently for a while. Calculation successful. Now the data has been calculated, and you can unplug the USB cable and MP decryption cable. Now the original car key has been restored. Then confirm whether the file has been saved properly. Click MO Programming. Click File Manager. Click Browse File. You can see that the file read by the computer has been automatically saved to cloud storage. This is the anti-theft data. This is the synchronization data. Now, let's use this platform to learn and generate the dealer key. Now connect the OBD cable properly. Turn on the device. Click Emo Programming. Select the corresponding vehicle model. Click Generate Dealer Key. Because the anti-theft data has only one ID, select the second option. If you select the first option, it may result in the original car key being learned, but the KD key not being learned. Or the KD key is learned, but the original car key is not. So select the second option. Because we have the synchronization data now, directly select the second option. Load the synchronization data. Now place the KD key into the induction area of the device. Click KDZ BSM ART key. Click 433 MHZ. Click KDZ B Smart Card Submachine. Click MQB Smart Key. Click Sure. Generate successfully. Note that the key should be placed in this way. If the metal head is placed face down like this, there will be interference and it cannot be generated. So please note. Now, we continue learning about keys. Learn to program two keys. 
Now we will turn on the instrument panel. 